Hi guys, uh, welcome to the Batch Tech and Data Science class. Um, today we'll be talking about how to run our first uh, project on Python. Last class we talked about how to install uh, Python and PyCharm. So, uh, my name is Bashir Alafi. Uh, so let's go right to work. Uh, the first thing you want, if you want to run your first project, first you want to you double click on the, the PyCharm app software. So, um, hold on, it's coming up. So there are, in actual fact, there are four steps involved in one hour about one uh, executing a code or a project in um, Python. Number one, you have to create the project folder. Number two, you have to create the project file. Number three, you have to write the code. And lastly, you have to run the code. Now, um, we want to write our hello world and we said there are four steps. So, the first step now, how do we create a project file? So let's go to our WhatsApp, our patch, um, our patch and ID. Um, right click, right click on what create new project. Now give um, your project a name. You can call it first project. Yeah, uh, uh, first project one. Here you can see the location and parts where, it, um, where the, um, your PyCharm folder is uh, stored. After giving, giving a name, the next thing you do is you click on create. And we are sent. So, so, just hold on a second. So, creating the virtual environment. So, uh, if you just take a, the process of creating a, um, a Python or a project, what it just takes some seconds. So we have done that. The next thing we'll do now we need to create our our, our Python word file. So we have done the first one. So I think so. The next thing we'll do. create our project file. So how do we create our project file? So this, this is what we'll do. Go back to our Python, uh, Python interface, you right click on the project, right click, when right click, click on new. Now either you create a new file or you create a Python file. Now if you choose by the Python file, it will create, you have you don't need to put the dot py extension. But if you click on the the file option you have to put the dot py so let's click on this so you can call this a, a first project one dot py you have to put the dot py extension and click on what type what so we have created our our, our project file the first step was to create our project the second step is our what create is to put is to create a project file which we have done. So the third step is to write is to write the actual code. So now how do we write the actual how do we go so the process of writing a code in Python is very easy and it's very what direct. Yes, and so the first thing we want to do the third thing we want to do we want to write the, the code. We want to write the hello world syntax. So let's go to our uh, by charm ID to just type print. Okay. Then type hello world. Hello world. So these are what we've written our first code, our what our Python code. The last step is to run and execute the code. So if you want to execute you to run. Then click on what the run button. Then you have to click on the file you want to you want to watch one. This is our, our first project. Click on it. You can see the result here. So writing a code and PyCharm interface is very very easy and it's very what direct. So very very easy and very what direct. So we are writing our what our first code here. So as I said before. Python is very very easy. It's not complex at all. So
so um so that's what i've illustrated here and that way so there are four steps you create the project folder create the project file write the code and execute execute it now before i go another way of running your code is you know, i've said the first way you can you can either go to run from one to here or press shift f10 or you click on this button here on the third part to run your code so yeah these are the ways of what of running your project so thank you very much see you all in our next python class have a great day everybody um,